Okay. Here you go. Watermelon. Mango. Kiwi. Gelatin Water Sugar Blueberry jam. Water. Gelatin. Chill in 30 minutes. Sugar. So yummy! Watermelon Match of powder, water, water, sugar, corn syrup, jelly powder. milk Oh, I forgot
forgot about the red color. Corn syrup. Sugar. Jelly powder. Chill in 30 minutes. Sesame. Oh my god, are you okay? I'm so so sorry. Can I make another cake for you? All right. I'm waiting for you. Okay. I feel so bad. Let's make it up with a perfect Oreo cake. Together, we can make it right. First things first, we'll crush these Oreos. Just enough. Come on. To the chicken coop. We need an egg. Thank you, lovely chickens. Here, let's crack this egg into a bowl. And oh, don't forget the sugar. A dash of vanilla will make it smell like a dream. Whip it up until it's as fluffy as clouds. Next, we add flour, cocoa powder, crushed oreos, and some milk. Mix it all up. Almost there. We can't keep our friend waiting, can we? Into the oven at 350 degree Fahrenheit it goes. Just 30 minutes and magic! While that bakes, let's mold some rainbow fondant balls to make our cake extra special. Making cakes is magical, isn't it? With our little creations, we can sprinkle joy everywhere. What do you think? Decorating time! My absolute favorite part. I bet you all have fantastic cake ideas too. Share them in the comments below. Every cake has its unique taste explosion. Bursting with flavors and love. Do you feel the same? to spread that cream. Smooth and dreamy. We're on the final steps of our journey. Oh, I love this sky blue color. The cake looks like a piece of a sky, right? Add a rainbow fondant and ta-da! Our masterpiece is complete. Thank you, little explorers, for being a part of this Oreo adventure. Here you are, my bad. Wow, so amazing. I love it, thanks so much. <laughs> wow, these candies are delicious. Let's have some. Oh no, the candy box is empty. Mine too. This box still has some candy. I'll use it to make a cake. Okay, I'll wait for you. Hello, everyone. I'm Lucy. Today, I will tell you a story about Lily's journey to become a doctor. In a quiet village, there lived a young girl named Lily. From a very young age, Lily had a dream, a dream of becoming a doctor and healing those in need. Lily's 
fascination with medicine began when she witnessed her grandmother, who was a nurse caring for sick patients in their small village. The kindness and dedication her grandmother showed left a lasting impression on Lily's young heart. As Lily grew older, she worked hard in school, excelling in her studies. She knew that becoming a doctor required years of education and dedication. Despite facing financial challenges, Lily's determination never wavered. She earned scholarships and part-time jobs to support her education. After graduating from high school, Lily gained admission to a prestigious medical school. Her journey through medical school was grueling. With long hours of studying, demanding coursework, and clinical rotations. Yet, she persevered, always motivated by her dream of becoming a doctor. Lily faced many challenges during her medical training. Sleepless nights, challenging exams, and the emotional toll of dealing with sick patients. There were moments when she questioned her path, but her inner drive and passion for medicine kept her going. After years of hard work, Lily graduated from medical school with flying colors. She proudly earned her degree and was now officially doctor. Lily, her family and friends celebrated her remarkable achievement, and the village was bursting with pride. Doctor, Lily returned to her village as a doctor just like her grandmother. She set up a small clinic to provide healthcare to her community, especially those who couldn't afford medical care. Her dedication and compassion earned her the trust and gratitude of the villagers. hope you enjoyed the story. Please follow the Mini Plus YouTube channel to listen to more interesting stories. Goodbye. I finished the cake. Wow, the cake looks so tempting. Let's enjoy it together. Oh no, my m and candy. Are you okay? I have another box of m and m candy. You can have it. Really? Here you go. I will make a cake for you. First, we summon the fluffy trinity, eggs, milk, and oil. And flour, of course. Now, the secret ingredient for ultimate and, and chocolate goodness. It's time to mix everything together. We'll bake the cakes for about 30 minutes. While the cake is baking, we can start making the frosting. I'm making a simple buttercream frosting made with whipped cream and sugar, but you can use any kind of buttercream frosting that you like. See, even clumsies can bake magic. Now it's time to decorate the cake. First, we're going to cut the cake into three layers. Now, we're going to frost the cake. I'm using a brown buttercream frosting for the base. Okay, so now it's time to smooth the entire surface of the cake with our creamy rainbow buttercream.
Okay, let's add the M and M. We want to make sure they look as good as possible. Finally, we're going to add a little bit of extra flair. I'm going to use a spoon to some brown buttercream around the base of the cake for a chocolate drip effect. And there you have it. Our M and M masterpiece is complete. Hey Lisa, come in and enjoy some cake with me. Wow, that looks amazing. Oh, thank you. I'd like to give you these strawberries as a thank you. Wow, really? Here you are. Thank you so much. jelly I've ever made. I will leave these two for my mom. Oh, wow! I want to make a cake that looks like that.
la 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 Wow! These strawberries look so amazing! I know what I'm making for cake today! Rainbow chocolate! I'll make a cake with it! Chocolate! Red color. Strawberry.
important. Oreo. Cream. Fondant. Fondant. The cake looks really tempting. to make a butterfly cake. It's so cool. Hi everyone, it's Lucy. Today, we're going to dive into a world of rainbows. Let's start with a rainbow egg. Try my recipe and let me know if the cake turns out smooth. Let's pour the batter and bake it. While the cake is baking, let's make the rainbow. Be sure to divide it into six bowls. How do you like the buttercream? Let me know in the comments. Cut the cake into four pieces. One, two, three, four. Pipe the buttercream onto the plate and cake. We're going to create a rainbow. Let's do this together. It's so pretty. Place the rainbow in. Add a little sprinkle and we're done. Let's enjoy this cake together. I'm Lucy, the best pastry chef in the world. Follow and support me at Minna Plus.